this disabled gaming reviews let's play it's best enjoyed in front of a computer monitor and or tablet with the speakers on and to any epileptics out there please watch this in a well-lit environment to reduce the risk of any potential seizures this DJR place party is also unofficially sponsored by boom and mini boom in air so boom and mini boom are a geek boutique where if you're looking for things like dragon ball mugs alien figurines etc etc definitely check them out did I also mention that they're an official Warhammer retailer? So if you're looking for extra fire team squads to add to your Tau army, definitely check them out. They are located opposite Airbus Station. Look out for the Deadpool statue. Links to Boom and Mini Boom's Facebook page is in the video's description below. Now, with all that aside, please enjoy the video. gentlemen this is it welcome to part 10 and the finale of my let's play of Max Payne for the PC so everything that's been happening in this game all leads up to this last part we've escaped the um, headquarters of the quarter headquarters of the inner circle and we've started our assault on the Asia Corporation building Hunting down the last mem surviving member of the um, and the circle beside Alfred Woden, Nicole Horn, who is who's been who on without authorization to create continue to project Valhalla, which came which became the Val or Valkyr, which was um, indoctrinated into the test subject. To whom a witch killed Max's wife. <sighs> Okie doke, so I am now I am I'm now getting a the time already, and without further ado, let's do this shit. The elevator lobby Max get us back up now. This is futile. A waste of time. The deaths of your wife and daughter were necessary. Inevitable. It is done. You cannot bring them back. Nothing you do will make it any better. Max Payne, you 
are fighting a losing battle. You cannot survive this. You will die. Stop fighting. Make it easy for yourself. Accept your fate. You will die here. So please. So in between these two parts. We pretty much had to take about two minutes of fire from Nicole, Ho Nicole Horn's personal attack chopper. So I'm just thinking now, nope, saving this, and we're going to start from there. So, apart from that, you haven't missed a thing. Let me reassure you. Send us assistance.
38 minutes. I
dead. The final gunshot was an exclamation mark to everything that had led to this point. I released my finger from the trigger. And then it was all over. The storm seemed to lose its frenzy. The ragged clouds gave way to the stars above. 
Max Payne, this is Deputy Chief Jim Bravora from the NYPD. We've got the building surrounded. Throw down your weapons and lie down with your hands behind your head. A bit closer to heaven. The cops' voices were distant and muted. Freeze! NYPD! Hold it right there! My ghosts released me from their haunting. Down below, New York City glittered like diamonds on black velvet. You gave us one hell of a ride. Take him down to central booking. You heard the man. Woden was there in the crowd, standing by the sidelines. It wouldn't be over till the man with the patch would say so. He'd say the right words. I knew he would. He'd better. Woden grinned smugly. It was the grin of a winner. That made two of us. And that is it for the original Max Payne. So I'm now at a, now at a standstill. So should I continue on doing Max Payne 2 almost immediately? Or do you guys think I should just go straight on in to Half-Life 2 Episode 2? As always, let me know down in those comments. <sighs> so a big shout out to um, my best friend, Open, uh, Andrew Openrack Carpenter, Pierre, Lucas, and Frederick from my um, Halo Discord server for the suggestions on how on to do Max Payne in the first place. So, and it has been an excellent project. It's been a lot of fun while doing this. I remember playing this game when I was a kid. Um, so, so yeah, what, what an excellent way to start off with this um, retro gaming takeover and disabled gaming reviews. So my first review of this takeover is going to be it's going to be a versus battle between Max Payne, no, not Max Payne, um, Streets of Rage versus Final Fight. So which game do you think is better? As always, once again, let the comments are just down below. Let me know. Predictions of the winners. Street to Rage versus Final Fight. And above all, and above all, the people you see in this screen right now, thank you very much for for producing this excellent game. memory So this is, this is Spartan Commander 1990, Chief Editor of Disabled Gaming Review, signing off. 
I will see you guys on the start of the next project, which is either going to be going straight into Half-Life 2, Episode 2, or Max Wayne 2. I'll see you then.